All right, we're here. There's no time for an intro. I just gotta, just gotta get in the water, and start fishing because we are like super late. We are just super late this morning, and it's um, and it's no good. You just gotta get in here and start fishing. So let's do it. Just got a seven-inch plastic on, a seven-inch Johnson, and uh, there we go. We just got. Running tide, a fair bit of wind's gonna pick up soon. So we've just got this little tiny window here. Hopefully we can uh, we can find a fish or two. One fish here I think would be all right, one decent fish, I'm pretty happy with, but um, take what we can get, take what we can get. Basically just, I'm weighted as light as I can. There's a lot of current here and there's a lot of bait here. So I just wanna waft through that bait. So just a, a one six, just wafted down, you know, through those bait schools. You know, I don't want to hit the bottom hard, you know what I mean? I don't want to be bouncing off the bottom, getting small stuff. I want stuff that's up actively feeding on those bait schools. So that's kind of the plan. And we are drifting our little asses off here this morning. We are drifting so fast, which is, I guess it's good to cover some ground, but yeah, there we go. Well, 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 dead as a doornail here so far. Oh, that was a bit of a bust, eh? That fish just bait, really. Uh, some more bait there. A couple of bigger shapes just coming down here. That's probably worth a drift back through. Tons and tons of bait. Tons and tons. I was a little bit wider on that first drift. You know, in that deep water, like out there. Come in a little bit shallower and... I'll drift through here. Just stacks and stacks of bait through here. Stacks. Just a swimmer. Oodles of bait. Oodles and oodles of it. So many oodles. Oh, it's all come up to the surface here. Look at it. Look at it go. Look at it go, this bait. How nuts. Just whether there's anything on it or not. That's mine. Yep. Oh, yeah. Just all in that bait there. Just wafting it through that bait. Yeah, that's good. Oh, that's a good fish. Big fish, hit it hard. Hit it on the run. It's coming up, it's coming up to the surface. I'll just back that off a little bit. That's a clean fish for sure. Oh, that's turned into a shark, has it? I'm fucking doing me here. That's turned into a shark for sure. That wasn't even on that long. Oh man, why do I even bother coming out here? Oh, he's let go. Or he's coming back this way. Come on, what have I got left of this thing? Oh, they're back onto it. Oh, sharks. I've got it. I got half of it back. It was a good snapper. Had it that whole time, that shark, eh? Look at that fucking snapper I had on. Bullshit. I don't know why I bother sort of coming out here. That's an amazing snapper. I was just testing a plastic that I made. You can't show you, but yeah, that would have been a cracking snapper. And now I'm basically like, why fishy? Why get up so early in the morning, track all the way out here, and you have like two drifts, and you, you hook an amazing fish like that, and you just get shark. Like it was on, you saw it, it was on for like 20 seconds. And like it hit it and it ran and it was great and then I was like, oh it's coming up the surface, it must be a queenie. And it started coming up and then just went dunk and then just boom, out into the channel, big shark, and then the shark eventually came up to the surface and let it go and I saw the full shark. So and then yeah, just wound the head in. So I don't know, I don't know. Like you can't keep fishing here because anything you hook is gonna get sharked. And it's just like feeding sharks, man. Like it's just bullshit. So I don't, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to bother fucking coming offshore for anymore. Like the last, like this is a big rant, but nine, nine, the last nine trips, 
eight or nine, this has been ninth trip offshore. Terrible. Every time. Terrible. You know what I mean? You're getting sharked. Mainly just getting sharked, really. Or if you're exploring new ground, that's fine, but uh, I don't know what to do, eh? I don't know what to do. Just keep wasting fuel and feeding sharks, so what can you do? I don't know. Keep it for fish head soup or like that's a good snapper man, hey that looks cracking snapper but it's just basically shark and chum now. Yeah, Oh, there's a fish. Yep. From the drop. Oh, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Got him. Come on. Come on. Come on up. Yep. Come on up. Literally. Ah. Oh. Oh, come on. Come on up. Come on up. Come on, son. Turn him. Big gold and something. Goldie, here we go. Oh, look at this. <laughs> Big goldie. <laughs> Big goldie, bros. No sharks either, too. That's good. That's good. Come here. Gotcha. Yeah, that's a golden. <laughs> right, now there's a proper golden. Look at that fella. Big fella. Big lips too. Look at that big golden there. How's that? Not um, not bad. Not bad at all for a tough morning of sharks and all that sort of stuff. But the old 7-inch Johnson getting it done. Right, let's get her back in. He or she. Get him back in. All right, I think she's pretty keen for a release here. It's like swimming. Oh, I'm just gonna hang it for a little longer because I know there's, there's sharks around, so I want it to be like super energetic, like literally kick out of my hands. She's, she's swimming, but I want it to like really rock it out of my hands. So. There we go. That's the go. That's how you want to release. Good release. Right, ah, uh, cool beans. Trying to get out of the wind here, and it looks like this bank here is going to be out of the wind. Oh, it's going to push us in. So, it's one of those days where we don't really get to fish where we want, we get to fish where we can with out of the wind and whatever. So, yeah, let's, let's cruise in here and see if we can make something happen. Going deeper on that other side. Oh, there's a big flatty lie there, though. That's good, flatted line in the sand there. See how clear it is here. That's good, that's, that's good, I like that. That oh, should become a stingray, fisherman. Stingrays and sharks, man, eh? Fucking good to go. Look at the, all the stingrays. There's one there, one there. There's two back there. There's one right in front of me there. That's five in this, like, tiny little space. Nothing wrong with the stingray population, that's for sure. There's like a little drain here though. Sitting around in this little drainy drain. Just, I've been casting over it anyway, but... A little drain here, maybe there's one sitting in there. So there's a fish. Hey! There we go. Yeah, oh yeah, I've done the trick there. Oh, sitting on that drain I was talking about before. Oh, little mate. Oh, he's not little, little. He's just like keeper size, legal size. Only just hooked. Only just pinned. Oh, hopefully just pull you in. Hey! Not a bad one. Legal. Why was all this fight when you're in the water? There we go, nice dude. Pinned there. Oh my god, where was this? I don't even have to unhook him. There you go. There you go. That 100 mil there. And you can swim off that way. Well, the water's actually quite warm up here in this little flat. Alright. Oh, no. Moving forward to this other bank here. Which is, well, 
don't know. It's not an amazing looking bank, but it's a drop off. It's sort of a drop off bank. Oh, and it's out of the wind, so. What is this thing doing now? What is it doing? What are you doing, you fucking thing? Oh, non stop issues with these fucking things. Right, anyways, what I was saying is uh, we're just getting out of the wind. That's all. Just getting out of the wind. Trying to get out of the wind. There's a squid chasing that. There's a squid. Definitely a squid chasing it. I can always, always get a squid chasing, right, on a normal lure. Look at him, two squid there chasing it. There, he just touched it, just grabbed it. But, if I put a squid jig on, look, third squid coming along. Oh, fourth squid. So many squids here. But, if I put a squid jig on, I can never catch a squid. <laughs> look at them. Look at them. Three, four of them. I don't know if you can see them or not, but there's like four squid there, maybe. Here they come, they're coming forward. There he is, gonna eat it. No, he's just looking at it. <laughs> no, they just look at it, they don't eat it. <laughs> they don't eat it at all. <laughs> Cheeky. They literally come over and looked at it. Didn't eat it. Weirdos. Oh, there he is. Oh, no. Just looked at it. There we go. He's got it. He's got it. There we go. <laughs> little squid. It's about time. <laughs> it's about time. No? Hey, look at that. Little squid. Little squidly. Just got to go real light on the squid. What is he, a little tiger squid? I think so. There you go, little squid. It happens all the time on lures, like you get followed up by squid and that. And they just... Yeah, they just never... There you go, get, your, get all your stuff out, mate. Get it all out. Get your ink out. Look how gross that is. Ink is, dude. Holy gross, eh? So gross. Gross, gross, gross. Is it all out? Let's bring him in. There you go, little squid. Little squidly. There we go. Tiny little squid there. Good to go. I think he's all out of. Oh, yeah, he's all out of ink. <laughs> oh, lucky. <laughs> he's pointing straight at me. All right, off you go, little fella. <laughs> Bloody squids, eh? They're down here again, eh? Look at them. There's one. Another one. Another squidly. A few here, eh? Oh, there's a bigger one too. Oh, oh, there he goes. There we go, squidlies. There's heaps of squids around, eh? Heaps of them around. Maybe we should take them and cook them. They are a pain in the ass to clean, though. They are a super pain. Little, oh, look at it. Look at his mate. This is where if you've got two squid jigs going. Sort of, so look, he's trying to eat it out of his mouth. Look at his mate, beautiful looking things, aren't they? Squidlies, oh, look at them all here. Look at them all. Look at them all. Another squidly. Oh, there's the big black smoke. There we go. Oh, he's still got heaps of ink in him. See how they change colour when they when they ink? Look at him, he's black now because he's inked. And he's trying to like escape. Still got heaps of ink in him, eh? See, look at him go black. Isn't that amazing? Like 
he inks and then he goes black. So you can't see him. But we can see you, mate. We're not silly. Do not ink over my deck. That'll just come out like that. Perfect. Look at him. Nice little squid. Off you go. Catch and release squid. Oh, he had a, still had a bit of ink in him, eh? He's alright. I just wanted to show you that that happens all the time when you're using lures. It's almost worth having a squid jig rigged up at all times. But yeah, it happens all the time. Fishing this plastic prawn or something like that. So, yeah. Should um should go out and get a couple for a, for a video, for a feed or whatever. All right, bit of a bit of a topsy turvy morning, bit of an early start, a few bites early, and then sharks. Obviously, a bit of an emotional roller coaster. I'm just going to scan this new bit of territory here, see if I can find anything. If I find anything, I'll fish it. If I don't find anything, I'm going to run back into the boat ramp because uh, I'm going to pick up a special guest, uh, Mr. Mr. Baxter, Mr. Bowley, Mr. Trouty Slayer himself. Um, my, he's really actually my adopted son. I've really taken him under my wing, you know. He's a good, he's a good kid. He's a good young man, you know. Um, I think he's, what is he, 16 this year? Anyways, we're gonna go and pick him up. You know, it's like a 10 o'clock now, so pick him up in about an hour. Then we'll do an afternoon session. We'll go and try and get out of this wind, try and get a few nibbles. And then we've, um, then tomorrow off to SCF comp. So that's kind of the plan. Um, yeah, we'll just uh, we'll just see what happens this afternoon. There's no no pressure. Just father son fishing. Just me and Bowley, you know, getting it done. Yeah, there's a few out your side there, scattered around there. Yeah, here, here. Oh yeah. Yeah, you're in there, mate. How fucking boy in there do you want to be? I'm right on them. <laughs> fucking spooked them pretty much. Where's the Get your camera on. Yeah, they're all they're all through here, both sides of us. There and then out about 30 meters on that side. How many rods do you want to use, Johnson? I worry about him sometimes, eh, Holy guys, I worry about him a bit. Look at him. He's so excited. Hasn't fished here in two years. Alright, oh, put that down. Oh, fish galores. Fish galores. Oh, oh, both sides. God. Come on, mate, what are you doing? Where's your camera? You're over it. Not even filming. What's wrong with you? Oh. Oh, my God. Need to go and get a meat pie or something. It's fucking garbage probably for Ah, Jesus. Square pot. No, real sus. Curry potato pot. Very good. Sus. Even Jacko gave it a thumbs down. The old pie man himself. On that side now. They're on the other side of us. How did they get around us? They've literally swam in around us. Guys, you give me the shit, eh? Hey? That's just the GPS coordinate. You should chase more flatties in the Proserpine, mate. Well, I didn't see anything there, so I'm ready to pull the plug, eh? Hey? Right, eh? Right. Here we go. Hopefully drift. A bit drifty in there, but... I don't think we're going to drift too far. Hopefully today's session, the morning session, goes better than yesterday. What? Yesterday's what? afternoons was a little bit depressing, hey? What? Yeah, super. Yeah, so much fun super not impressed by it, eh? Super windy. Super sweet. People to impress on the internet. Let's go! Oh no! 
That just turned into a shark. See how quick that was? Because you didn't use enough muscle. Oh, he let go. What, let else, go. Get him. what else could I do? No. <laughs> That's a shark. That turned into a shark so quick. He let go, bro. That was your last second of smoking him. Yeah, he's got it well and truly now. <sighs> Why do I even bother, dude? Definitely a shark. Definitely a shark. Definitely a shark. Shark snapper. Hundred percent. Took my leader and everything. That's amazing. I love it. Are you ready to move? Here you go. Scissors. I don't think we just stay here and just keep getting fucking shark. That's just that's just fucking stupidness. What's it? You slaying them that five minutes there, I was tying a leader. I'm just jealous that you were catching so many, so now we gotta move. Oh! That's the bottom. No. That's a fish. It's actually a fish. It's the trevally. You having fun? I've actually hooked a fish. Today, you have? It means I get my $700 for guiding you today. Big Trevally shakes, eh? That's very weird. Lots of wave are just coming up. It's a giant big trout, bro. Right? Side on the sun. Oh my god. Where are you? This is a colour. Oh, come on. Oh. <laughs> it's a trout. proper big trout. You are the world record holder for most fucking slayed trouties, too. <laughs> Fuck, that's a big troutie, dude. That is a horse trout. Hey! <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm wigging out on that. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Good job, son. You're kidding. I'll put you on the spots, mate. See? What the hell? That's like... That's a massive That's trout. like a 70. No, come on. Peel the mat back. Oh, 69. Yeah, it's fucking 70. Yeah, I guess. That's 70. Big tail pinching, yeah. yeah, yeah. Fuck it. Sure you cut that out. <laughs> Good, Matt. You look good. How's that? Proper. That was probably one of the last things I was expecting to get, like a 70 plus trout off after like the last, I don't know, how long were we fishing? Like two hours. Not even a sniff of a fish. And then just get an absolute cracking trout. I'm pretty happy about that, Drew. For sure. There you go. Yeah! The spirits are lifted, eh? <laughs> Big lifted. Oh! No! Very graceful. No, he's chilling. <laughs> he did go, I'll give you that. 